too. There's money, yeah, plenty yeah, of time. Right. So, first question. Okay. Why music knives? Uh, I'm a bored pothead. Bored. I'm yeah. a bored pothead. That's, That's why pretty much music. why I've done music. I yeah. don't know what else to do. Right. I got into it at a very, very young age. We couldn't get girls. We were just skateboarding, right. smoking weed. Playing bass? Playing bass, playing guitar right. and bass. With your buddies in high school? In high school. That's how it right. all started. I just yeah. never stopped. Yeah. I don't know what else to do with bands, my life. Bands, bands, bands. I've always been in a band. You were, you got burned though, and when you first came here, you were fucking against the music scene. Yeah, but I hated the music scene. I didn't want anything to do with the music scene anymore. Right, you were, you were burned. I hated the music. I went through the music what scene. You, did, how, what burned you? Um, what jaded you? What made you fucking hate it? My name not being on a record, my own record. Oh, that's weird. I left the band and they recorded a record with all my songs. What band is that? Uh, the Trip. The Trip? Yeah, Mr. Oh. Saga Bass Band. Huh, like Aaron's Trip. The Trip. Yeah, The Trip. Yeah, the Aaron Bell's cool. Trip. But like, that's you know, it bygones. Like alternative, be alternative punk. Yeah, it was like punk, yeah. That's cool. That's what it was. And you were pissed. I wasn't necessarily pissed. I was pissed at the whole industry. I was pissed yeah. that everybody wanted to make pop songs because we knew how to write the formula of a song. So instead of right. writing a song because you wanted to write a song or it was creative, yeah. because spur of the moment, Same old bored song. pothead, right. uh, people started writing songs calculated for radio. And wow. that's what I didn't like. Yeah. Everybody wanted to be famous. There was no being a, a, a dumb stoner musician traveling anymore and the, the whole industry. The touring of, thing. Uh, I of, love those stories. Yeah. Touring the Californian coast. I don't remember. I don't remember. Tours were like drug induced, uh, comatose. You. You were so fucked up. I was tour, fucked right? up. I don't even remember it. Raspberry, right. Raspberry or strawberry? Or Six uh, weeks, so I don't even remember. Two or three club sodas? Two, three. Two club sodas. New York's were, New York's were fun. New York, Montreal's were fun. Those are the ones like... New York like, and Montreal. Those were always fun. New York? I don't know. <laughs> you were so fucked up. <laughs> I don't know. And where did I play in Montreal? I don't really know. A lot of either. booze. A lot of booze. A lot of weed. A lot of weed. A lot of... Other things. Other too. things. <laughs> Other things as well. Let's talk some Hanoi gossip. Huh? Did you see that picture of Lexi? Yes, I did. What? Do you know anything about that? Uh, not really. Who beat her up? We don't know yet. We're thinking, Paul and I had a discussion that we think it's that crazy Thai girl who hangs out at Spy Bar. Uh, we all well, know. The, but I, I'm not I mean, sure. That girl with the weird dreads, with the dyed blonde dreads, she put that girl's picture up, who they said, because did you see the picture that was up? No. Because somebody asked who beat you up, and then some that girl with the dreads, you know the girl I'm talking yeah. about? Yeah. Yeah. Funky Jungle. Yeah. And so she put up this picture of this girl and said, this is the girl. I'll, uh, I'll get her right now. Yeah. Uh, that's some, you know, drama. Man. There's too much fucking drama in this town. You love it though. It's it's re <laughs> it's reality it. television it at its is. finest. It, it is. is reality television yeah. at its finest. It's always some fucking drama. There's and it's it, always the same characters. Yeah. yeah. You know, Wrong like man. what's the, the name got in the bad morning? The, the the character development hasn't really evolved, but the, yeah. the you know, but the people here in Hanoi. It's a soap opera. It's a soap it's, opera. It's literally a soap opera. Some people think they're still living in high school. Popularity and fame. It's um, Hanoi, you know. The joke is, it's Hanoi. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. It's really cool. It's a good thing. Sounds great. Um, who, there was that guy who uh, got in a bad motorbike accident. Mike Watkins, eh? I don't know that guy. He broke his pelvis in two places. They put him up in the French hospital. It was like three hundred bucks a day. So he owes them two thousand seven hundred bucks. Well, look at that, Joe. Joe Wood. English uh, Joe. He's going to have his foot chopped off? He got his leg chopped off. I saw the Why? pictures today. Why? Uh, something motorbike about his accident? motorbike accident. He broke oh. his arms, his legs. Uh, yeah. It was here in the Vietnamese hospital. I think they didn't do the surgery properly. Right. Um, something about the artery. Mm. Um, so I think it was bleeding bad into screws, bad hardware maybe. Bleeding into the muscle and not actually healing, healing properly. So he went back. And so he had to go off. back and it was like pretty. That sucks. I would never wish that on my worst enemy. You know that guy? I do. Yeah, I've, I've I probably do. seen him around. I feel very, very terrible for that. 
That's that's, rough. that's hard. Um, we only got three minutes. We only got like two minutes. Um, and then what is uh, what bands are you in right now? Right now, I'm in the King Louis and the Revolution. Right, I know. Uh, That's which is reggae. reggae covers that we do. Yeah, reggae rock. Yeah, reggae sublime. Pretty big band. I just saw them last night at Rockstore. That was it was a fat sound. It's eight member band, sometimes eight, ten. Yeah, Jesus Christ. Sometimes ten to. And there's two white guys, a lot of black guys than you. Yeah, <laughs> on the bridge, on yeah. the bridge. You gotta watch your black accent singing in there, dude. It's a little dicey. <laughs> well, remember, I'm from the, I'm from the Caribbean, so okay. you're gonna, you're gonna hear if okay. I start yelling. You can play that card. I can play that card. <laughs> if I yell at you, you can hear it come out. And if I'm right, what's your island? Trinidad and Tobago. Trinidad and Tobago. Right, yeah. right. That's funny. But yeah, King Louis and the Revolution. That's one. Rebel Monk. Rebel Monk is a big one. Which is my... You say it's like the top band in fucking town. Right? My pride and joy. One of the top bands in town. That's what people say. I'm, right. I'm not sure about it, but right. I'll take the compliment. <laughs> and repeat it. I'll, yeah, and repeat <laughs> it. I'll take the compliment. Record it and make a video. Uh, and uh, a new one, a, a writing team, Los Tarantes. Yeah, I like that one. So yeah, that's just... That's mainly you and the uh, Uruguayan guy? Yes. Joaquin. Right, and so, a little bit of Mac. And whoever else wants yeah. to join involved. Mainly you and, and Joaquin. Joaquin and I are, are yeah. pretty much writing that the Joaquin songs. Guy is super nice. We're writing a lot of the songs. A lot of some of the songs are some of my old songs. Right.